All right, we are on the road again. It's a beautiful Monday morning in southern Utah. And we are headed up to Springdale for a Tesla Model X. Apparently the key fob is dead, and so the vehicle won't start. They've been using their cell phone to start it, but it has to have cell phone service. So we're taking the cell phone booster and the winter to roll back, and we're either going to tow them somewhere where they can uh, get cell phone service and get their car started, or we'll hook up the booster, cell phone booster, and see if we can get them running. So we'll take you along for the ride. Remember the Cable Mountain Lodge? She's looking a little different now since it flooded. Did anybody get wet? What a mess. All the mud's gone, everything's back in tip-top shape. Look at the big wall they built for flood retention. It's looking good. All their landscaping's redone. There's no mud in the driveway anymore. How amazing is that? And hopefully when it floods, it'll run right down through this alleyway that we're going down and run directly down through here and drop in the river. So we'll see how it does here. There it is from the last time we were here. This was like 30 inches of mud. We was pushing cars through it. So what we did is we gonna see if we can get service on that old girl and got the Wilson going. See what she does. We dragged this thing around the back of the building and now it has network, whatever that network is for Tesla. So now it's unlocked, everything's working. So here we go, we'll unload it. in the view this job's pretty much a bust well we're on the road again we're up bright and early I think it's a Wednesday morning but we're headed up to Kolob gonna get up there and work on a generator for a cabin that's up there we're gonna sneak up there in the old Cherokee see how much snow we got had a late winter storm come in so we're gonna get up there and see what we got going on and We'll take you along for the ride. Getting into a little snow. We got a foot and a half or so on the road up here, just on lower Kolob. We're uh, just about to come outside the park. So we're only about two miles away, maybe three miles away, but we're working our way in here. Moving right along, as you can see, got snow blowing everywhere, breaking tracks.
tell me I shouldn't complain about my job, you're probably right, because look at what I get a look at this morning. I'm the only one been in here, it's just a beautiful day. Man, look at the view from up here. What a place. Jeep, got a snow drift on it. Poor dang thing. It just says unknown engine fault. Okay, you're back on the auto now. Remote start, it still has a shutdown warning light. Should I acknowledge the fault? Yes, you do have to. Okay. All right, I acknowledge both of those. set reset gen set reset that sounds funny anyways we've got the old generator up and running so it can keep those batteries charged and uh, keep the heat on in the house up there it's an off the grid cabin so we got in there and we had a heck of a good time blowing snow that fresh powder sure fun to drive in with a nice base underneath it so sure is a pretty place I'll tell you one thing for sure, we was blessed with a little moisture. We were about to suck an egg as far as getting it through the summer with our water reserves that we don't have. So it was sure nice to get a little moisture. I got a new squeak in the Jeep, driving me batty. But anyways, it was a pretty good time run up there and got that generator started and no complaints. We're just working our way up nice and slow and past a few people coming up up taking pictures and checking out the beauty it sure is neat to see that red rock covered in snow so thanks for coming along for the ride all right we're on the road again it's been a busy day we started off headed to Kolob first thing it's kind of a crazy morning got up there and had to get a gen set going for a off-grid cabin to keep all the batteries and the heating system working and all that good stuff so got that taken care of first thing this morning and man it was sh sure a pretty day on the mountain breaking tracks and doing what we love so we're headed down here gonna meet up with Leon and the boys and see if we can go to get this big Hereford bowl loaded we got to run it out to K Kayabab out by Kanab Utah we're gonna get that old thing loaded up get him over there and we'll take you along for the ride see what we run into today So the goal here today would be, <laughs> he's not happy, but to get that bowl in the trailer without him eating us for lunch. They say, old man, huh? You say, he's not very, he's not very friendly. Hi, old man. Ooh, hoo, 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 hi. Oh yeah. Come on. Ooh. I don't know who's more scared, me or you. Oh gosh, that was scary. Whew. Mercy sakes, I don't know how we're gonna get him loaded. Hey, get it, get out of here. He's not very happy about things. Boy, we got our work cut out with us for us. Hi. Hi. Hey. Jeez, I don't trust. Well, there's backup plan. Leon in his Chevy. I mean his Dodge. I mean his Ram. Or whatever he calls that thing. Look at this thing. We've got a Chevy emblem on the front 
<laughs> we've got a power stroke emblem on the side and another Chevy emblem in the BR5409. He lost a Ram sticker in the car wash the other day. What's that all about, Goobler? Well, I don't know. That Dodge glue didn't stick on for nothing. Huh. You boys ready? Yeah. You look ready. You look pretty good on those mules. My mule? Well, yeah, that other one's kind of a mule, too. Random things you see in Hurricane. That's my mule. Hey, that's my mule! Thieving suckers! <laughs> that other fish. <laughs> Backing up for. <laughs> you getting in there? Get on him! Oh, 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 oh. I wouldn't get in there. You'd. Okay, so this one needs to need some. Sam, get him in here. Sam, get him in here. Get him Go in here. Hold the gate. I am holding the gate. Decoy. Oof. Get him! Get him, Mickey! Sick him! Yeah, he wants you. He wants you. Ah, hey! Yeah. Hey! Hey! Get him! Get him now! Hey! You right! Hey! 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 hey. Get the door. Get the gate. Here, Sam. Don't get ran over. Don't get me involved. Hey.
Charlie got my adrenaline going. <laughs> Woo! He's as bad as the last one. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> He's one you don't hurt him. He's one you let him chase you in. <laughs> that was exciting. I got my adrenaline up there a little bit. That big old boy, he let us know who the boss was. And I wasn't going to get in his way. The old dog wasn't afraid, were you? Huh? That's a good old girl. Get in there and get him. Huh? Anyways, we had a good old time. What do you say, Goobler? That was a good one. That's a good one? Uh, he's not afraid to eat you. No. Nope. You, you don't herd him into the trailer. You ch let him chase you into the trailer. Yeah. Leon kept trying to get him into the trailer using himself as bait. I don't know how smart that is. It's not smart, but it works. Anyways, we're going to head over to Kayabab and drop him off. He's about a three-year-old bull, and he's a rank son of a gun. So we'll take you along for the ride, see where we end up. <laughs> 